Hello and welcome to the channel. Today I'm going to be trying to reshape the ball cap you see here um, a little more to what it used to look like. You can see now it's really flat, has a lot of wrinkles in it. Uh, this is a 100% cotton cap. It is unstructured so it's never really going to be stiff here in these panels. Uh, these front too anyway but I think we can make it look better than what it is right now uh, let's put it on the head and see what it looks like okay so I got the uh, velcro adjustment strap where it fits um, I guess it's not horrible uh, I don't really like the wrinkles that are in it kind of, kind of like mine to have you know, a firm uh, front here to be a little higher, but uh, I mean, it's not terrible really. But I think we can make it look a little bit better. And the way I'm going to do it today is a pretty easy way to do it. So now would be the time to wash the cap if it has any stains you're trying to get rid of. This cap looks pretty much like it's brand new, so I don't really need to clean anything. But uh, I am going to get it wet, so uh, I'm going to begin by just getting it. Just rinsing it, getting the whole cap wet. If we want to completely restore the shape of this thing, so we're going to start from nothing here. Okay, so I've got something that uh, I use, and you know, you don't really have to use one of these, but if you can find something to stretch your ball cap over and try to get as many wrinkles, if you're trying to get wrinkles out, which is what I'm trying to do, and firming, firm it um, on the front, then uh, you'll need something that will really stretch and give you a good shape. So I'm going to go ahead and, uh, and put the cap on the, the head here. And here's another option. Um, you know, this is what you can use to wash your ball cap in a dishwasher. You just put it in here. It's got a bottom and a top. You could probably use this. I've never really done this, but you probably put it on the bottom one. May, may make it look a little too wide, but uh, something like that might not be too bad. So that's a possibility. However, we're going to stick with uh, what I usually go with, and that's going to be the mannequin head. And I really like that. Okay, uh, next thing is to get out uh, the starch, which is what I always use. Now this is a different starch than I have been using. Nozzle here is not working very well, but I'm just going to saturate the front of it. You know what? Let's switch to the old starch. All right, switch nozzles anyway. Let's see if it'll... Yeah, much better. So, uh, you know, it's according to how much starch you want on it. That's quite a bit right there. That's going to stiffen those this two panels up there quite a bit. All right, that's all we're going to do. We're going to take it outside. We're going to let it dry in the sun for how long, how long that'll take. I'm thinking maybe at least four hours. Okay, so we've got some overhead sun it's about 70 degrees here today it's noon so I'm gonna let it sit out probably come back this late this afternoon and we'll take a look at it I'm sure it'll be dry by then but uh, yeah that's what it's looking like right now hopefully it will be that shape uh, when it dries so uh, I'll get back with an update 
Here we are now five hours later. Cap is completely dry. Look at that, that's nice. That is nice. So that worked, that worked great. Let's take a look at it on the head. That is the easiest way that I've ever restored a ball cap back to its original shape. And it's not structured there, so, I mean, it is stiff. So here we are with the ball cap on the head. Uh, a lot less wrinkles than before. It's actually got some pretty clean lines now. Firmer. Um, sits a little higher, which is, you know, kind of what I like. So I'm pretty impressed with the way it turned out and I'll be doing this uh, more often with some of my ball caps. Um, the brim there I noticed is a little, a uh, little asymmetrical. This side over here on my right dips down a little bit. But you know what? It took me a while to really even see that. I was actually, actually had to look back at the uh, what I just videoed to see that. So uh, yeah, I'm not worried about that really. Uh, I guess that's going to be it. Thank you for watching the video. Until next time, have a nice day. Take care.